Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we will be discussing nine mistakes most of the programmers make while learning programming languages. When you feel like you are in a mood for an achievement, you are itching to do everything at once. You open several web pages and start learning a bit of Java, then a bit of PHP, and then you give short glimpse at JS frameworks. By the end of the day, you think you know a lot of programming, but no. See how you wake up the next morning and suddenly realize you remember next to nothing from yesterday. Several hours of study for a zero result. Well, that's a trick of learning anything new. Focus on something. Java, then only Java. Stay with this strategy for at, at least first few months. Later, it might be even beneficial for you to go to other technologies and try them together in a real project. Skipping the fundamentals. Who cares about the simple alphabet when you can start writing your first novel right away? Why waste time doing something only losers would do? Yeah, right. Skip the dull fundamentals. Why would you bother learning anything about classes or inheritance if next big thing is waiting for you? Well, not exactly. Learning the basics is the brick and mortar of your future career. If you don't do your job building it carefully now, you will stumble over it for years. When you get a real job, you might really be very short on time to go back to basics. So the best moment to slowly move from point A to point B is now. No, you are not the smartest crayon in the box. So don't skip learning the fundamentals. The next trick which is connected with the previous one, learn regularly. Think consistently is just another buzzword. No, it's not. This is the way the memory work. You have to repeat things several times before they actually become a skill. And without any further use, the skill you worked so hard to build will vanish out of your memory again. That's why several hours of study with several days of oblivion is a direct course towards failure. Learning programming for 30 minutes per day is better than 3 hours of practice every other Monday. I will do it on my own. I thought coding was about typing the right lines. Why would I need people? These are some of the excuses I have heard for not connecting with other people while you learn. Yeah, if you envision yourself hiding behind a monitor and coding genius things in solitude and silence, well, say goodbye to this illusion. No matter how introverted software developers are, their profession is about teamwork. Yours will be true. On your learning path, help from peer may also be crucial. And who knows, maybe you'll also meet your future colleagues or even employers there. Where? On the programmers forum, professional communities, etc. Come join forums like Stack Overflow or Reddit. Talk to others about your studies and work. Ask for help. Help others and get inspiring. And get inspiration. This will definitely speed up your profession skills and which might be even more important your soft skills. Only reading, watching videos and reading again. The more you read about programming, 
the better programmer you become well no theory only even if it is in form of bright youtube cartoon won't get you far unless you also practice try some coding challenges platform play games and learn by doing here are some online options i have picked for you connected git connected is a community full of tutorials resources for learning programming all materials are filtered by software engineers and developers so the quality of content is super high here members not only learn but communicate with each other to find the best possible solution to complete the tasks code gym code gym is a structured java course that combines lectures and practical task here you start doing task from beginner level and get to the confident middle level the whole course is built as quest that involves gamification and storytelling doesn't it make whole process much more interesting coder byte this is source is a challenge and problem solve resolution based the starter courses a huge library of challenges with marked level of difficulty and a job interview preparation tools code chef code chef is a place for friendly competitions it also has starter courses and monthly challenges see how your name will look if you become one of the top performers Let's get back to the learner mistakes. At first, you will really just learn simple coding, but the repeat after me. Type of uh, tutorials cannot last long. Creating software is not only about writing lines and lines of code. It's about making something that would help people. fill some gaps and solve some issues that's why you have to start figuring out how to so resolve problems with your coding not just doing monkey business the thing is you won't receive task at work like write 50 lines of java code they will mostly come like we need this thing to work this way can you do that and here when you either can or cannot try coding challenges like those mentioned above for drilling problem solving skills not being sure whatever you write is working in the make the new world developers create idle code from scratch and it miraculously work all at once but in the real world things are way more complicated you write and write features for some app and then oops the app just won't operate and don't you actually know what's wrong whether things went wrong one by one or several at time and now you have to check up on everything from the very beginning good luck a much better option is to double or triple check every part of your project before you move on to the next step then the chances you create something good are much higher never admitting you wrote bad code it's hard to realize you made a mistake 
it's even harder when there are plenty mistakes every day and in every line of code but pretending that it's all right and should be this way is even worse so face it you will write a lot of bad code and you will have to rewrite it every now and then it's inevitable and it's a part of a process audit your code and if something has to be changed go and change it not letting your code be reviewed by anyone more experienced than you when you're learning to play a musical instrument you barely wish to show anyone your sluggish finger movements the same goes for code until it's perfect you don't want to show it to anyone it's common that beginner developers don't ask for help and refuse to seek advice you can only imagine how much longer and harder the learning path becomes because of this ask for reviews of your code from someone who has been there before go to the professional communities and forums example stack overflow code project or code gym forum to your tutor if you are a student and discuss it with your fellows you will get different perspectives on resolving the same problem and more than that you will learn better and faster as you also gain knowledge from experienced developers by the way there is a nice after effect you will be able to share your knowledge with next newcomers to professions which is also quite rewarding it does require time and effort to learn to program but you don't have to complicate the process with mistakes every newbie programmer makes if you only read and don't start practicing if you never let others review your code if you don't acquire a co a problem solving approach it will take ages for you to become a professional if you only read and don't start practicing if you never let others review your code if you don't acquire problem solving approach it will take ages for you to become a professional and remember the very worst thing you can do is never even start learning or give up after the first failure stay strong mistakes and flops are part of the process don't get discouraged every time you do something wrong the most important part is that you learn regularly and improve your skills eventually start right now and good luck to you Thanks guys for watching my video please do like share and subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon to receive the latest updates and all the website links are in the description